In this video, I'm going to show you how to split a given amount into a given ratio. We're going to use swan diagrams that look at a known connection and use that to find um, the values of other connections. So let's just see how that works. 48 grams in the ratio of 3 to 5. That's 3 parts to 5 parts. So that's a total of 8 parts. And with swan diagrams, we um, join that total of eight parts with the total amount we've got, which is 48 grams. And we know what we want to find is three parts and five parts. So ratios are a proportion problem, which means that the multipliers um, across from any number of parts are identical. So what is the multiplier that gets from 8 to 48? Well, to work that out, we just do 48 divided by 8, which is 6. So the multiplier is 6. And that's the same multiplier for every part. So 3 parts is going to be equivalent to 3 times 6, which is 18 grams in this case. And 5 parts is going to be 5 multiplied by 6, which is 30 grams. And we can see that 18 plus 30 is 48, so we've probably done it correct. So the answer to our problem is going to be 18 grams to 30 grams. Let's see a slightly different problem. Let's split $30 into the ratio of 1 to 2 to 3. It doesn't matter how many bits there are, but that's one part to two parts to three parts, which is a total of six parts. That's the total. So we're going to join that or connect it to our total amount of money, which is $30. We want to know what one part is, two parts and three parts. Remember, this is a proportion problem, so the multipliers have got to be the same in every case. So what's the multiplier that gets me from 6 to 30? Well, we do that by doing the division, 30 divided by 6, which is 5. And it's going to be the same multiplier in every case. 1 multiplied by 5 is 5, 2 multiplied by 5 is 10, 3 multiplied by 5 is 15. So the solution to our problem here is going to be $5 to $10 to $15. I hope that was helpful.